There are still a lot of unanswered questions surrounding the pipeline shutdown, but this morning we're getting a better look at what could happen if it lingers on. Here are three possible outcomes. According to a Wells Fargo analyst, if the pipeline, which is run by an Alpharetta based company, is shut down fewer than five days, there will be no significant or lasting impacts. Six to 10 days, refiners may need to reduce how much crude oil they process. If this happens, you can expect inventories to rise in the Gulf Coast, causing prices to fall there. Meanwhile, prices in the East Coast could jump, and this is where we may start to see gas shortages in some parts of the Southeast. And if it shut off for more than 10 days, then refiners in the Gulf Coast will most likely have to reduce their runs. Oil prices may weaken, leading to significant gas shortages in the Southeast. The Federal Motor Carrier Safety Administration declaring a regional emergency for Georgia, 16 other states, and Washington, D.C. Just two days ago, the White House is allowing more tanker truck drivers to carry fuel up the East Coast. The story will continue to develop in the coming days. For more information on its impact and gas prices, be sure to head to 11alive.com.